Are you looking for easy rigging? Some cool effects like lightning, ice, fire and stuff? Or maybe you're into free assets and controls. If that's so, then you're in for a nice treats. In this video, we have eight free tools for you to try it out. So like the video, sub my dude, and cue the music. We do also have a list of over 300 free tools and add-ons for you to get. Links should be down below. At number one, we have the Rig Creator, a new tool to create bones and link constraint in an intuitive and efficient way to manage all your work. This one should be convenient and practical for even starters. However, you should keep in mind that this tool is still under beta, so it's new and things might still need upgrade. Available on Gumroad for free with easy download, so try it out if you're animator or want to learn about this, might be handy for your work. You can find a tutorial down in the page. And also, if you go into the download section, there you can find more information with some of the old versions on this for more options. So, have fun. Next in line, we have a Lightning Draw Free Blender add-on, a tool to simplify the process of creating procedural lightning effects, which enables you to generate photorealistic lightning with ease on your object. So if you're in some Marvel or Mortal Kombat moves, this one can make it easy done. Available on Gumroad for free, equipped with a variety of tools and parameters that allow for extensive customization, so edit it as you like. Fair to say, I tried it with Blender 4.1. The add curve option did give me an error, don't know why, but it works smoothly when I add my curve, which is fine for me, and it looks cool, so give it a try. You can also go into the geometry node behind this. Inside are more ways to control with easy nodes if you want to study this or make something similar. At number three, we have Terrain Sketcher, a set of node groups which you can use to sketch terrain blockouts in Blender. Sounds cool, isn't it? You can find it on Gumroad for free. The installation also is fully explained there, so follow them steps to get started with this and create your funky environment. There's also a video or two to show you how this works, might be a bit long, but you can watch that if needed from the playlist down in the page, so have fun. Next, we have the Freezing Effect Generator Free Blender add-on, a long name, but with easy job, and that's to do ice on your stuff. From the same page of the Lightning Draw tool we saw earlier, and it's all free to use, so get it, Free Fire is more available than ice. This one creates a procedural ice frozen effect on your object with one click, so it's easy to run, but it's a bit heavy with the default numbers it start with, especially the density, so drop that for easy navigation. This one requires Blender 3.5 and above to run, so check the information before you start, get the file, run it, and make things cold. The DD Gobo Light Asset Pack, a large variety of light textures for realistic outcome in your shots. This one is on the free paid side, and you can get some of the samples in the free version to try it out, but still awesome, so why not? Available on Gumroad, with a direct link to download. So give it a try first cause Gobos are fun to have, and the options it delivers can take your work to a new level.
Next, we have Drop It, a free tool designed to drop objects in a simple and fast way to the ground or the next surface. It also contains many cool features like only parent effect or alignment to surface normal. This can help you set objects easily if you're doing some movement animation and level them all in one click. Available for free, and it's been a while like this, so get it if it feels cool to have, because it will be handy in one way or another. At number 7, we have the Flow 4 Asset Tool for Blender. This one can speed up your workflow and improve your scenes. And it's also on the free and paid side, so the option for you to go free of charge while exploring it. Available on the market with the link down below, a tool designed for improving your whole Blender workflow to stop wasting time while browsing your folders and just add your assets easily with a few clicks. This make creating your scene faster than ever. You can read all about it in the page, watch some of the available clips with it, and also the free side options is down for you to know what you get, so have fun. Last but not least, we have the Interactive Physics Editor, a simplified process of positioning multiple objects in your 3D space with collision handling. Thus, objects will dynamically shift out of the way of the object you're moving and prevent them from passing through one another. Available on GitHub for free, and also there's a paid version on the market, but I don't know if it's for author support or a more upgraded one, non the less. This one is awesome, and been there for some time. This can make Collision more fun to play with, might do some funky stuff with it. And that's it. Like and share if you care, and see you in another video. Stay sharp. Goodbye.